Good morning everybody, it's Gina. Welcome back to the Firefly Studio 67. Today I've got my first four entries for my friendship journal that I'd like to share with you guys. I was so excited to start seeing these come in because as I told you I was kind of nervous about um, asking you know, for participants for this challenge because it, it did require um, you know, them to create something. I thought, oh, I hope it's not going to be a flop and nobody wants to join. But luckily, uh, some ladies have decided to, to participate. And I'm going to start with the first entry here, and this is from da Dawn. Um, I'm not going to give last names. I don't know. I just feel like to protect people's privacy, uh, as I said, you know, if they've got a YouTube channel, I'll put those links below, or, f you know, if they've got like a blog, anything like that, I will s certainly share. Um, but this is Dawn's entry. Dawn is from the UK, and I think Dawn really has my style down. I absolutely love these birds. Gorgeous, gorgeous image. I, she must have. Feels like she's decoupaged that on there, and then she's got a little um, banner tuck spot, and then these beautiful butterflies. She, looks like she's done some glossy accents on that. That is stunning. Oh, I can't wait to see this um, journal come to life. <laughs> so here she's got some lace and a few little flowers put onto this pocket. This is beautiful, Dawn, because um, I love blue and it's very difficult to find blue in our um, you know digitals and, and things to work with. Love that journal card. That's beautiful. And then you've got a nice little writing space here so I love that Dawn. Dawn has written me a, a little personal letter here so I appreciate you doing that Dawn. Um, that means a lot to me because you know, as time goes by, and you guys know my my memory is not great already, <laughs> as time goes by, I want to have these things to go back and um, and know who they who it was that made it. Now here's Dawn's business card. Um, she has I I won't oh I don't know if she I won't put her number. Oh goodness, Dawn, if you'll clarify with me if you've got a shop. Um, but she obviously does 3D keepsakes, um, jewelry, and scrapbooking. So I I don't I won't put it there, Dawn, just because I don't know if if you you would want, probably not want that on the the web. But Dawn's got a business card, so I will clarify with her if she's got an Etsy shop or maybe another little shop. If so, I'll come back and alter that list uh, in the description box. So, oh, and she's also put her name here. Brilliant. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Dawn. That is wonderful. And again, the birds. They're just, uh, I love, love birds. That's a beautiful tag. Birdland. So then she's got a nice little pocket here on the side so that this will hang over, which is, is nice because that way you'll have more texture. And then I love this. This is a book page she's created a pocket with. And she's tucked in these little... Um, tickets here. Oh, and she's made a little writing. That is so sweet. So I can make a little note behind that. That's been tucked in. And then she's got a double pocket here. Beautiful. That's an Artie Mays. And another bit of writing on the back. Gorgeous. Oh, look at this. Thank you, Dawn. Thank you, thank you so much. Absolutely beautiful. Really pretty. These tags are gorgeous. So thank you so much, Dawn. I appreciate that. And as soon as I get that journal together, we will be going back over these. All right, guys. Let me put these all back as I'm doing it. Because I'm trying to keep myself a system. <laughs> um, okay. So on to this next one. This is another... UK friend, um, Pat. Pat has sent me this beautiful page. And she knows I'm partial to uh, shades of purple. 
And I like that Pat put this beautiful little bee tag. Isn't that gorgeous? And she's got her name from Pat Page. Now, Pat, I, I've not seen anything showing a YouTube channel, so uh, maybe I'll discover that coming through. Look at this beautiful little notepad. So I've got lots of little writing. I love it! Absolutely. And the images. Look at that little girl. Isn't she sweet? Fascinated. Just beautiful. A lot of little details. I love the little rhinestone that she's added. It's just gorgeous. And look at this little bee charm. Love it, Pat. Thank you so much. Beautiful pocket there that fits that nicely. And then she's done stenciling. A lot of work. A lot of work has gone into these. Fabric pocket, another little bee there, and these pages. I did have a quick look, Pat. These are gorgeous pages. I don't know what book she got those from, but look at that. So I've got some more writing space there. But I end up, you know, you see these things. Oh, where did she, where did you get the book? <laughs> I love those pages because the illustrations, it's just nice, you know, to see different, um, things that people are working with, and to now have some of those in my hands is wonderful. Love it, love it, love it, love it. So she's had all that tucked in there. Hang on, let me get that so we can see it. Tucked in and too far there. I like that. And then over here, this is a gorgeous image. It's like a fairy, a flower fairy. Oh, this flips up. So we've got writing space here. Oh, and she's lined it with some lace. Beautiful, Pat. And then that flips over. So I've got even more writing. So this is awesome. Really, really nice. Love the papers that she's chose. And this is just gorgeous. This is a little um, book page uh, pocket floating envelope that she's created, but it is just beautiful the way she's collaged that. And the coloring, I'm not sure, it almost looks like a bit of the um, avocado dyeing going on there. Just really, really pretty. Stitching, you know I love stitching pads, so thank you. And then another beautiful little um, butterfly tag. <laughs> I have to say, guys, um, and this some extra bit of writing. Oh, this opens up. Wonderful. Oh, that's beautiful. And look at her collaging. She knows I love bees. Thank you, Pat. Beautiful. So yes, I have to say, guys, this has been very emotional for me when I've received these. Um, as I've opened them, uh, yeah, I found myself really, really um, emotional over the that you guys have sent me something that has been handmade. Love the collaging on that. That's gorgeous. And a little, little bit of um, shimmer on there. I hope that's picking up on the camera. That's beautiful. These just so pretty. A little outfit. Oh, look at her. Beautiful. And then inside she's tucked me a couple of little things that I could use. Aren't those beautiful? It's just little writing cards with the envelopes. And... Um, I appreciate that, Pat. I will most certainly use those. Those are the images are fantastic on that, so those will definitely get used. So thank you for for adding those little extras. And then that just tucks in there and back under here another little altered paper clip, and then this beautiful flower with interesting memory. I love it. Thank you so much, Pat. I'm going to, um, I just can't wait to get the journal put together now. <laughs> it's, it's, I'm not a very patient person, guys, so um, to have to wait until um, April is, is going to be a true test for me. Okay, so the next run came from... Canada! Yay, Canada! So this one I will turn over because I don't want to show the address. 
This one is from Barbara. And Barbara's included this beautiful little feather in there, which I love. I'm going to put that to the side because I don't want to lose that feather. I love this. Oh, Barbara, you know I'm loving the snow. I miss that. Now, Barbara lives in the Rocky Mountains. That's the part of Canada she's in. Um, so that's, that's really nice. She's written me a nice letter on the back, you know, telling me some things about herself, which I really appreciate. And that I will include inside of here, Barbara, when, uh, when I get the journal complete. But I love that extra little uh, thoughtfulness of a postcard because I, I like to see where everybody lives and imagine what life must be like, you know, in that part of the world. So here we go with the Barbara's entry. This is beautiful. Look at the all of the charm she's included. So pretty. So here she's got hello, beautiful buttons that she stitched on with lace. She's put a doily behind there. A lot of layering going on, which is beautiful. Oh, here's another feather. Okay. I will put I'm going to put it to the side, but I will add that back in with the other feather. That's gorgeous. I love that little charm. That It looks like stained glass. That is beautiful. Is that a little? No. But that's a beautiful little tag. And that tucks in there with the feathers. So I'll add those back to it. And then she's got, um, <clears throat> down here we've got a tab with an amazing charm on it. Look at that. Now I'm curious, Barbara, did you make these little charms? They are gorgeous. I've never, ever seen any like that, and I'm very much intrigued. Same with that one. I'm really intrigued. And you know I need another craft to start on. No. <laughs> but I am curious how she's done that. Beautiful. Little tag. And then we've got this. Oh, look at that one. Oh, isn't that sweet? Tiny, tiny. I love really small things. I think you guys probably know that by now. And then this is beautiful. Beautiful. Hmm. Three table progressive. I'm not too sure. That's interesting. I'm all, When I see stuff I don't know, I always, this is why I can't get anything done because Afterwards, I'm going to have to go over now and look this up. You know, this is how my brain works when I'm uh, creating, guys. <laughs> I get so easily sidetracked because now I'm curious, well, what game did that come from? And am I missing out? Because I'm, I'm a game player. I don't know if I've ever shared that, but I love to play games. Love the tab. That's a beautiful addition. And, of course, the charm. Because I'm charm challenged, I just go crazy when... Um, I see charms online, and, and believe me, guys, I have tried. Oh, everybody's got the easy, easiest tutorial for charm making ever. I've tried them all. It's just not for me, so um, I wish I could, but I, it's just not something that I, I can pick up easily. I love this. A lot of texture there. Beautiful. They're little books, so that is just so... That just speaks to me because I love journals. And look at that, the good old maple leaf. Thank you, Barbara. That is wonderful. I love how she included that in. I love maple trees. Absolutely love them. And I have a small Japanese maple in our um, garden. <laughs> like Every time I say yard, I'm like, no, it's, it's the garden now. <laughs> so I've got a small Japanese maple, and I love a maple tree absolutely love it. So look at this. She's got this beautiful feather with the ink. Uh, and then this opens up. I love this. So, oh, look at more charms. And she loves feathers, I can see. Look at that. Oh, that's a beautiful little notepad, Barbara. And then on, on the top she's got the feather. Well, I guess being, oh, it's a paper clip. Oh, my gosh. Love it. I was going to say, being from British Columbia, I would imagine she does have a real 
attachment to feathers with all of the wildlife. That is a clever book. Uh, Paperclip, Barbara. Love that. How genius is that? And then look, here she's added butterfly and dragonfly charm. I love it. So I've got so much writing space with this. That is just perfect. And if I want to, I can replace that because she's made it so that it can, when I fill it up, I can replace it. Awesome. Gosh, it is just, I love all of the charms you've included. Thank you so much. That's really, really thoughtful. And then again, another one of these paper clips. Oh, I love that idea. Absolutely love it. Oh, I'm going to have to get busy. Busy, busy, busy. This is what I, I, I love about um, this friendship idea. I just think, I don't know who came up with it. I've seen several ladies doing it. But I love the fact that, you know, years down the road you can go back. Because I won't always be able to, to craft. You know, there will come a point, And you just think, how nice is it going to be? And the friendships that are, are formed from this community. I mean, I have made some amazing friends. And this is, I believe that little tag was in here. Sorry, I got distracted. And uh, I think that one was up here. Beautiful. Uh, feels like a um, tissue paper flower maybe she's made. So that's beautiful. And then some fabric back here. And then the trim. And then another tab, which I love. And then she's got this beautiful little charm that says handmade. I love it. Oh, that one. I think it went back here. That uh, tag. Yes, it did, I believe. With the feather. And then here we go. Did I do that? So here we've got that little card. I The image is gorgeous on that. Beautiful lace here. Butterflies that she's fussy cut. You've got this scroll paper back here. And then the buttons. Just beautiful. Barbara, thank you so much. What a beautiful book page to be treasured. Okay, I am going to tuck that away. And I have one more to share with you. Let me see how we're doing on time. Yes, 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 yes. So this package has come all the way from Texas, the Lone Star State, yay! <laughs> um, this is from Barbie. Uh, Barbie is contacted me and it is just amazing. Um, she looks, I saw her picture and I was like oh my gosh that's my Aunt Barbara that has to be my Aunt Barbara <laughs> so I instantly had a connection with um, Barbie and oh my gosh Barbie when I opened this up amazing look at that I mean where where in Texas did you find such an amazing um, napkin it is beautiful because most you know, I look around here even, and I'm really struggling to find pretty napkins. <laughs> that is absolutely gorgeous. Chicken, I love that. Oh, I love it, love it, love it. This is a beautiful journal card. So she's created this beautiful, um, it's a paper bag with this pocket, and then she's tucked in. So I'm definitely going to be keeping that because I am crazy about that there. And then look at this. Um, this is beautiful paper that she sent this in. So <laughs> I'm trying to very carefully pull it apart because I want to use that. To, you know I'm going to be hoarding this forever and ever. <laughs> um, 
just beautiful. And I love the sound, of course. We, we have to have the sound, don't we? So I'll sit that over to the side. I want to keep all of these things together. Oh, what a beautiful, beautiful package. So this is like a, um, well, it's just beautiful. It's a like an altered... Um, what am I trying to say? File folder card is what it, what it looks like. I don't know. She's done stenciling. She's done fussy cutting. Decoupage. Beautiful. <laughs> and then look at that snippet. And oh my gosh. Is there ever a more beautiful little ceramic bead? That is just gorgeous. It, it, love it. And see, I would think, I'd look at that and say, oh, I can do that. I can't. I can't do it. So thank you, Barbie. <laughs> and then she's here. We've got some more little charms. Oh, that, let me pull this out first and show you the rest of it. Isn't it beautiful? This is absolutely gorgeous. I love the image. I love the flower. Or stitching. Oh, and then stitching over here. It's just beautiful. That snippet roll is just amazing. And then it's this just this is what I'm saying. You get all of these things in your hands and you're like, oh my gosh. Just amazing. Look at that. She's made the faux stamp. It's beautiful. I love it because it's so different to everybody's images. And this is my little letter from Barbie, which I have read and it has touched my heart. Um yeah, it, like I said to you guys, I, I have been very, very emotional opening these things. And um, it just means so much. I, you know, some people don't value handmade, but I just love it. It, it comes from, you know, my upbringing. We were, we were just brought up, you know, that if somebody takes the time to make something for you, how much more that means than walking out to the store and picking up something off the shelf. Beautiful. And then she's got this. It's like a, um, it, it's not a bur, it might be a burlap, but I don't know, burlap canvasy type. Just beautiful. So rustic nature. Love it. Love it. Love it, Barbie. And oh my God, look at him. Is he the sweetest thing? Her stitching, I, I I must get a new machine now. Look at that. It's like a fern. A fern stitch. Hello. <laughs> I mean, did, I didn't even know that existed in a sewing machine. So, Barbie, now I'm in trouble. <laughs> I'm going to be on the internet, like, looking up a, a fern stitch machine. <laughs> Beautiful. And he's just gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. So, look at that stenciling she's done. Very um, nature-inspired. Love it. And on the back, I mean, it's all the fussy cutting, the tabs. Your tabs are fabulous. Really, really fabulous. Love that. And then look here. Look at the layering that she's done with. I, I the amount of work that's went into this Barbie is amazing. Because I know cutting each of those out, oh man, I've been there. And that takes a load of time. <laughs> and then she's got the uh, definition. It's got fabric under there, fussy cut, die cut. It, it's just amazing. So let's go inside because I'm getting worried now about the time. So here I've got an amazing pocket, which is Great. It particularly, I can see that I'll probably, probably have him inside. I think that's what I'll do in the journal because that will look really nice and I can keep you guys, all of them, <laughs> together. Love this. Absolutely love this. Another label and her um, snippet. What would you add? Snippet. It's not a snippet roll, but you know what I'm saying, like a edge snippet. Beautiful. And the, it's the coloring. Everything is just so perfect. 
<clears throat> another I love this fabric I don't know that is just amazing and look at this ah beautiful and then this is some handmade paper I can tell beautiful oh wow look at that so that comes oh isn't that beautiful paper she's stitched all of that so you've got you know the page back here which is looks like that's created a pocket and then you've got this for writing it's beautiful absolutely beautiful and then that closes I love these closures you know I I do Oh, look at that. Her faux uh, stamps are beautiful, and that image is gorgeous. Oh, wow. Look at here. That is beautiful. That frame. That is stunning. Ooh. I wonder. That is just beautiful. I'm wonder, wondering if that's a graphics fairy image. Oh, look at him. Just beautiful images. Oh, and even when that's out, she's placed that. Oh, it is where dreamers become doers. Oh, I love that. It's beautiful. And look in there. Another beautiful pocket. I wonder. I won't try to put the other one because of the um because this, I'm afraid that one might stretch it a little too much. That's absolutely gorgeous. And then on the back, look at that. Oh, Barbie, thank you so much. Absolutely love it. That is amazing, guys. All of you have done, you put in so much work for this journal. And I cannot thank you enough. And I wish all of you good luck on the uh, giveaway. So I hope that that now has given everybody else some ideas on what they can do. And I hope that you all will, will join me in, um, in participating. So I'm going to go now, guys. But thank you, thank you, all of you so much again. And I will be back very soon. Bye.